there was a lot of emotion, a lot of excitement, energy, and enthusiasm in that first year. OU, of course, in their backyard at the old All Sports Stadium the last year. And then here's Tech in the conference for the first year. They win it. They're the number one seed. Everybody around All Sports Stadium that night, you could just feel that it was it was going to be an interesting game going in. It certainly lived up to it. Texas Tech would fall behind five to nothing in the top of the second, but the Red Raiders would have an answer in the bottom of the inning. Rips it up the middle. It's five two. Here come the Red Raiders. Tech would take its first lead in the third on Joe Smith's first home run of the season. Oh, Baba. And the Red Raiders opened it up with a six run sixth inning and they weren't done either. And by, by the end of the seventh, it's 17-11, and you're thinking, all right, this game's about in the bag. But Oklahoma had other ideas. It was a dogfight. It was the, the end of the, of the tournament, and everybody exhausted their pitching. You just kept, you, you couldn't get out, you know? You, you, you just kept thinking there's got to be ways to uh, somehow uh, stem this, thing. And, and no. The Sooners scored seven runs in the eighth inning to take the lead for good. In the end, the two teams combined for 19 extra base hits, 40 hits in all, with Oklahoma coming out on top 19 to 17. Score 17 runs and you really expect to win. This, for whatever reason, it wasn't meant to be, but it was a great experience. It stung so much then to, to see Texas Tech not win that game, but I just now have so much respect, you know, for the game itself that, you know, sometimes you forget which side of that 19 or 17 you were on. No, I don't. That's not true.